most of the time. Um, we, you know, we talked about the rain and, but so it's easy for us to get the whole seasonal depression thing. Mm -hmm. And I think one of the ways that I have dealt with that on keto is, and, you, and some people may have also experienced this, I might still be doing keto, but maybe I'm eating more than I need to be eating. Right. Uh, so if I really like a <coughs> sugar-free Lily's chocolate bar, instead of eating a half a bar, <laughs> I'm gonna eat the whole bar. <laughs> and then I'm gonna maybe think about then what else can I eat because because I am dealing with something emotionally. Right. And um, and so I think I've, I've noticed that about myself. So, because I think we've done keto long enough where I'm not gonna go get a donut. Right. I'm not gonna go eat a pie. It ends up being more but, of keto, right. more ketogenic. But food I'm gonna than eat like more to eat. of the keto right. stuff that I know right. I can eat. Which is better. That is a step. Don't get us wrong. Yes. That is a step for sure. If you're going to have a Lily's chocolate bar versus a real chocolate yes. bar or yes. a gallon of ice cream or whatever your, your red light food was before, that is definitely a step in the right direction. Yes. But yes. you also know that, you know, doing that can't continue for a really long yeah. period of time or what the goals that you're trying to meet or the goals that you're trying to keep. Yeah will be a lot more difficult for you to maintain yeah and i noticed you know i just started uh tracking my food again uh using what it, what's that called carb manager um, i had never used carb manager before thought i'd give it a try i actually like the app but um i did notice as i'm tracking my food the days when maybe i go over some of my numbers which is interesting i don't really go over my carbs that often the net car i don't go over that that often at, at all uh some but i will go over fats sometimes and sometimes i'll go over too much protein mm -hmm. but as far as what what it's suggesting that i have but i also look at it i think it's those days when i'm probably dealing with something emotionally or maybe i'm under some stress at work and I'm probably just eating out of habit, right? And grabbing stuff just because just out food of habit. is a yeah. comfort for most of us, you know. Yeah, we've been taught to eat when things are good and eat when things aren't good, and so sometimes it's just a reprogramming of yourself, maybe yeah. doing something else, finding another hobby or another habit that right. you could perhaps turn to right. besides eating right that's when you're when you're feeling down and depressed it's easier to uh want to reach out for stuff that you're comfortable yes. with and yes. i think though when you get to a certain point on keto like I, you may be like me you might reach for more keto stuff